My name is Marx Kosman. I'm 38 years old and I'm a senior designer at Lego Technik. My educational background is uh, industrial design. Before I start building a model, I go out and try to get inspiration. For Marcus and the other Lego Technik designers, the best place to get inspiration is the real world. When building the bulldozer, the designers went to a gravel pit and drove a real bulldozer to see and feel how a machine like that really works. And then we start collecting a lot of pictures. We put on a big board, we call it a mood board. The mood board is full of pictures of different machines. The designers now have to decide which machines they will turn into Lego Technic models. Then we will look what could be interesting for this year to do. For this year we found out that it would be very nice to do something with tracks. So therefore we decided to develop a new track system, which should be included in the main model for this year. And so we try to find every kind of different models we can get with tracks. Having looked at different track-driven machines, the designers decide on a bulldozer. When we start the building process, we start with the functions. We try to explore how we can create this function with Lego bricks. It's full with interesting functions, where you can drive with it, and you have the blade and the ripper and the motor which is running. So it's much more fun to kids will play with it. You can do something, you can push all your Lego bricks and clean up your room. After we have defined all these things, then it gets, it's time to get started, to get hands on the, on the bricks. So then we're going to start building sketch models. A sketch model is the very first version of a new LEGO model. The designers build sketch models to get an impression of the model size and to try out different functions that can be built into the model. The LEGO Technic motto is Authenticity, Functionality and Challenging Building. Authenticity is um, that we try to build a replica of the real stuff. Kids can easily decode the model. If I build a bulldozer, it's a bulldozer. And if I build a truck, it looks like a truck. Functionality is that we try to define the functions of the model, which are the key functions. If you have a bulldozer, for example, it's a blade which goes up and down. Challenging building is, because we work in Technic for the older kids, we have a lot of bricks. We have a real lot of bricks. Like this model has 1,500 bricks. It's not so easy like uh, system building, where you put bricks on bricks on bricks. We build in all directions, and this makes it challenging for the kids to build. Authenticity, functionality, and challenging building. This is the very soul of Lego Technik, something we must never forget. Marcus and the designers have narrowed down the number of sketch models. They are down to two models one with motor and one without motor. And now they must choose which one they want to continue working on. But first, the two models have to be tested. For that purpose, the designers have asked a group of kids to come and play with the models and pick out their favorite. And the winner is... Model B. The result of the kids' test was that they wanted to have the model with the power function, with the motors. Even though the other model was bigger with pragmatics, the love is that they can remotely control it with the new power function system. Lego power functions enable kids to build with power. The system consists of a remote controlled motor that can be built into any Lego model. Not only Lego Technic models. We live with Lana, big kids, so we try to test our models in our own way. In the winter we got outside and try to push as much snow as we can with the bulldozer, or then we go inside and try to see how much it can actually pull. So we have a lot of fun building these models.
when we finalize the model, we build the model over and over and over again. It has to be perfect. First, when every function is spot on, we're done. When a LEGO model is finished, there's still a lot of work to be done. The bricks have to be produced, building instructions have to be made, and everything has to be put into boxes. So it's no surprise that Marcus and the other LEGO Technic designers are very proud to see the first box with their new bulldozer model come off the production line. Now it's ready to be sent out to the customers. And so the model is done. And now it's your turn to have fun with it. Happy building!